Hey guys today I will show you the best way to win trials. First let's start off with fruits. You want a good fruit that can cover a lot of space. In a small room. Here are some examples that I will explain later. First is the Buddha fruit. First off when you transform it grants you more defense. The other reason is the Wake and Be move. It can basically reach everywhere on the map. Next is Dragon. Basically the same as Buddha but it can fly not much to explain. Next is the Shadow Fruit. The Shadow V move is impossibly to escape. The C move drains health which makes it useful because it can heal. Next Venom Fruit. Venom has very overpowered poison damage. When you transform and use Toxic Fog, that can cover half the room. Also the poison damage is insane. Next is Rumble Fruit. First almost all Rumble moves can stun people. The Rumble B move can be used as soon as the match starts. It also has three charges like mini flash steps. Finally the Blizzard Fruit. This fruit is the best for trials, because Blizzard Domain can shred health really well. Using Howling Wind and Blizzard Domain will get rid of 7000 health on your opponents. Next important thing are fighting styles. These are some fighting styles I recommend. First Electric Claw. Electric Claw is easy to get compared to God Human, costing 5000 fragments and 3 million belly. Also most attacks are easy to land even on Buddha. Overall for Electric Claw it can do well in damage, and it's easy to get. Next is Death Step. Death Step is very good, in this case because once again it's a small room. Death Step's V move makes your kicks, at burn damage. I would say use this if you know how to use it. Properly if not don't use it. Superhuman is next. Superhuman is a bit hard to get but it's basically the same as God Human. You want to use the X and C moves on Superhuman because they have good range. In a one-on-one -on -one Superhuman can be very useful and you might win the one-on-one. -on -one. There isn't much bad things about Superhuman except how you get it. Also if you use Buddha it will be a good combo. Finally it's Sharkman Karate. Sharkman Karate has good travel distance making it useful to escape attacks. The X move can be good for moving enemies. However it could be hard to use because this one you have to aim, unlike Electric Claw. Overall I suggest using this if you know how to use it well. But I suggest using Electric Claw because it's easy to learn. Here is my ranking for fighting styles. Now I will rank fruits. The reason why Rumble is so low is because people mostly use it for stuns and put stats in sword. Dragon is number 5 because you can't use them one when transformed. Guns and swords to use. Swords are Yama Saber and Toshida. But I suggest use Saber because it's easy to get. Guns use Kabucha or Soul Guitar. If you are not max level use Kabucha. If you have Soul Guitar use it. Now I will break down how to win. Here I usually start with Howling Wind but I missed. Then I use Blizzard Domain. I let them attack each other and stayed back. Here I tried to finish it.
I didn't know if I was teamed with the boot or not. When low health, use your V3. If you have V4, use it in this fight. And there you won trials. This gear is better than the other one. Remember to talk to the red orb. Here I will show you what shark beefer looks like. Also before the video ends I want to make an announcement. At 250 subs I will do a giveaway and it will be a challenge. More information will be on the Discord server that I will link below. The server will have events and giveaways but I will let you guys know here as well. If you own a private server let me know please. But for the challenge let's say it's a 1v11. Join the Discord for updates. But that's mostly it. Subscribe as well. Here is me fighting Sea Beast. Also, Flame is good for trials as well.